Okay, when you're doing the autofocus fine-tune, it's absolutely imperative that the plane of your camera and that chart on either corner of this chart up here is perfectly perpendicular, I mean 90 degree angle. If your chart up here is skewed, then if you look at either side of the chart, one way or the other, then you're going to get wrong information fed to you that it's going to tell you to obviously change uh, your focus and autofocus fine-tune either fore or aft. So that chart has to be perfectly perpendicular. If it's skewed one way or the other, then you're going to have an issue. Your camera also needs to be laying perfectly flat relative to the chart. Now the chart is, of course, at a 35 degree or 30 degree angle, between 30 and 35 degree angle. Um, here I have tested another lens. Let me zoom in. You do not need to go into Lightroom to do this. You can just do a cross comparator between the two. Here I am, see, at image one, you probably can't see this very clearly. Image one, image two. On image one, this particular lens is uh, shooting uh, too close. In other words, the autofocus fine tune needs to be adjusted to the rear. If your lens is focusing too close in the chart, in other words, this particular lens was uh, front focusing since I'm on image number one right now, image one shows that four, number four, is more in focus here than the furthest away, number four. Let me actually pan up a little bit. So this 4 is much more in focus than this 4. So it was um, front focusing. It's front focusing, you want to push the focus point away. So you're going to add in your autofocus a fine tune in your settings menu, you're going to be pushing that away. So you're going to be adding it right now. This is a plus 6 after adjusted. Now both 4s are equally in focus or out of focus depending on when I look at it. Image number 1, not calibrated. Image number 2, calibrated. So in image number 1, 4 is very much in focus, but the furthest away 4 is not in focus. This is very easy to do. You do not need to take your card out laboriously and go into Lightroom to do this. To adjust that, like I said, you go into Menu, Setup Menu, Auto Focus Fine Tune. Okay, My saved value for this particular lens, not for the whole camera, See, saved value is for each specific lens. Default value is for the whole damn camera. Don't want to do that unless your camera's screwed up. Then you'd want to change the default value. In other words, your camera's got an issue with every damn lens that's on it. At least every CPU lens that's on it. Manually focus, it doesn't make any difference. List of saved values. This lens is saved at number one. So, there we go. Imperative. Let me shooting in aperture priority. Imperative that you need to be in mirror lockup. You don't need to have a cable release. It's not that bloody important. I'm on a tripod here for God's sakes. Imperative that your chart up here is absolutely perpendicular to the plane of the front of the lens. Perfectly perpendicular. If the chart skewed this way or this way, you're going to get the wrong results and you're going to dial in the wrong autofocus uh, fine tune adjustment. So, anyway, um, thanks for watching and I'll catch you later. Okay, bye.